Um, I haven't posted a bass fishing video in a while, and I actually haven't gone bass fishing in a while. It's been almost like three weeks. Um, also this probably will be my last time using this bait caster in a video because I got another bait caster. Um, in my house, and I'm planning on using that. So, yeah. So, um, today's gonna be a bass fishing video. So, let's see if I can catch anything. Oh, oh, that one, that one. Alrighty. Okay, I'm out here with my brother today. Um, get the hook out. I'm not gonna be fishing with the Senko probably all day today, but there's a nice little bass. We'll just let him go. Um, Eight ounces or something. Go grab some more sand cuts. Right, like a minute into the video, and I already got a bass. So. I'm gonna go grab some more sand That was not even lying, that was first cast. For me at least. They're all like over here. Oh, Oop, I missed them. tree was that close to the uh... I think I just lost my sand girl. I'm pretty sure I just lost my sand girl. No, I had to stop one. I thought I lost it for a second. Some bubbles up on the surface. Oh, I see a shadow in the water. I think it's a carp or a giant bass or a, looks like a 30 inch carp. I'm gonna try and catch it when I know it. Oh, I spooked it. There it goes right there. I 
hope I break a PB this year. I mean, last year I did, and the year before that I did. I just want to break a PB this year, that's it. I just want to, the fish I want to catch this year are a carp, pike, and a smallmouth bass. Fish, those are fish I never caught. Which there is a pike lake, probably like 30 minutes away from me. And then there's a smallmouth lake, probably like 10 minutes away from me. And then a carp pond, obviously, right here. Which this pond's probably about like 8 minutes from my house. I see what I so. oh. oh my gosh, I just lost my sand guy. Surprisingly, I didn't get backlashed. So. camera yet. You good? What? Why? You want a tank up here? Here, take this. Use it. It's what? I, oh my gosh! Dude, what? Dude, did you see that thing? Did you see my rod? You work it like a net rig. Dude, that thing was big. Dude, that's what I hate about treble hook lures. You always get them stuck in your line. And treble hooks catch everything else besides fish. I haven't caught a fish in a wall pocket in about like a year or so. Some of that's amazing though. You know, I might just catch it over here real quick just in case. Any bass are hungry. I haven't cast this thing a mile.
In the middle of the water. Oh, no, oh my gosh. Right there. Oh, crap. He flew, but it was literally right there. Whoa. 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 Buddy. Buddy. Buddy, whoa. Okay. He ate it right at the bank. He's flopping like crazy. I just want to stop. Well, there's a bass. Just want to clean, clean them off a little bit. Okay, well, there's a nice little bass. Say bye bye. Ooh. He ate that right at the Right on my feet too. That was cool. Ooh, it's a cool looking bait. Hey Lou. It's not, it's not even hooked. What is that? Well, you keep it. That was pretty cool though. <sighs> looks like, I don't know if it's just me, but it looks like the stem collapsed. You might just be from the angle on that. I don't even know. Oh no, it was just me. No, it did collapse. But I caved in. That's weird. Usually I would stand on that and fish, but might as well just walk a popper. There was a bass right there. Did you guys see that? I don't even know if I got that on camera, but there was a bass right there. Look, he literally swam out and destroyed this part. Whatever that stuff was. It was a little bass. It wasn't a big bass. Still a bass, though. Let's see if there's any trout up here. Yeah, there's a couple of palominos. You guys can see those. There's a couple. That's a nice palomino right there. The, the oxygen levels are like so bad. I think the bass are like destroying them or something. So this pipe gets fresh water from the creek. That's why the trout are up here so much. I'm not gonna snag it. Looks pretty cool. Never caught one before. I hope to catch one this. Well, I don't fish for trout in the summer, so. Ooh. I don't know if you guys saw that. Something attacked my whopper flop up there. I'm giving another cast out there. Alright, see ya. Who's picking you up? Who's picking you up? Okay, see ya. Alright, Leo's leaving. He seemed pretty bored, anyways.
That's my first bass out of this pond this year. All my other bass I caught out of that pond. Oh, oh my gosh. Dude, dude, what? Oh my gosh. Whoa. Get on up here. Holy moly, that's a big one. I got that on video too. Whoa, you're big. You're pretty chunky. Oh, he just spit my little right there. This is a nice pass. He's really chunky. Dang. That's a really nice bass. You know, he's a little bit... But... It's a really fat one. Holy cow. Alright, I'll put this guy back. He seems really big. And look how chunky he is. Holy cow. Alright. <sighs> Watch him go. Send him out there. Dang, okay, that was a really nice blow up. That was my first ever top bar blow up. Okay. That was nice. I got my first ever top water blow up on camera. It was a really nice bass. So I'll tighten up my drag a little bit because I had it really loose. I could not really feel it, like. Yeah. All right, well, that's it for this video. Um, I'm not gonna fish for the rest of the day. I'm gonna go home real quick and I'll make another video probably tomorrow. Probably the other day, I don't really know. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Um, I didn't beat the record today, but I probably, hopefully will beat it tomorrow or whenever I make my next fishing video. Uh, so thank you guys for watching and bye.